Yeah, good afternoon. It is hot after Abuja is hot right now. And I'm giving you update from what is or what has happened in court already from the witness testifying, you know, in court. He was cross examined by the INEC and the APC Council. And uh, before then, let me give you a little update of reaction of people that uh, they think that the live update that is coming from the obedient family it will if will affect the judgment or the proceeding in court. Personally, I don't think so. And this professor, you know, was featured in uh, uh, Channel's television and he made it known that it is impossible that this, the, the judicial system is an entity, is, is a body of its own. So let me allow you to watch it a few minutes, then I will come back and give you the full gist of what happened in court today as to the cross-examination. If you have not subscribed to this channel, do where to do so. And as well, follow and click the, the bell icon to get much more information as it happened immediately from the court. The judiciary is a, is, is a statutory arm of government that has a duty to perform. Now, aggrieved parties have a right to express opinions on what they expect from the judiciary. Now, if the opinion of uh, aggrieved parties outside of the law and the judicial system is deemed to be pressure, I don't understand what kind of pressure that is. If, for instance, you're in the hospital for surgery, is appendicectomy that's about to be carried out, and some of your relations are outside and they are complaining that, oh, the, this doctor should do this and the other one, it doesn't affect the diagnosis. So let's put a few facts straight on the table. Number one, if you go into a contest, it means you accept the rules of the contest. So if you go for an election, your expectation is that you'll either win or lose. Now, part of also of the, demo, part of, part of the tools, or what you find in the toolkit of the democratic enterprise, is the judicial process. So you go for elections, results are not satisfactory from your point of view, you move to the next level, which is statutory, which is mandatory, which is constitutional, that is the law. So you go there, you also don't tell the judiciary to finish it in 30 minutes. You look at the existing law, you have a law, you, you're supposed to go through this at the tribunal for 180 days, you have another 60 days at the Supreme Court, I think, if I have my facts right. So you can't jump forward and say, oh, you know, I've become impatient, stop it. No. So what am I leading up to? There are opinions, there are concerns, there are even hysterical reactions to what is going on in the judiciary regarding the elections. It is the, the duty of the judiciary to conduct itself with dignity. The little I know of what should happen in a court is that the, the, the presiding uh, justices will say according to the evidence before me. Now, if somebody is shouting in the, outside the hall, or people are wrestling at the stadium in uh, Surulere, and from, from there they are making comments, should that distract somebody who has evidence before him? So I think also there has to be some greater discipline in the conversation regarding this matter so that we don't begin to assume or pretend that what does not matter matters. Come back. This is um, what happened in court today. Hebe Mohammed's son is crooks examining the witness now. And he is the son representing INEC. Where were you on election day? Witness at my polling unit, and I voted. AB, your voting went on smoothly, and you were commissioned to produce this result. Witness, I was requested to produce it, and you were paid for it. No, I wasn't. By the witness, AB, you acted as a particular Nigeria. Witness, yes, AB Mohammed, going by the terms of reference in your witness statement on oath in paragraph three, the primary source of your data was IREF. Porter, witness, yes. And the word for to say, in your witness statement on old, you made reference to EC8A, a report uploaded on IREF. You, you are referring to the same thing? Witness, not really. What are you referring to, A.B. Mohammed? Witness, the, the means the EC8A are uploaded. A.B. Mohammed, in your entire analysis, the form EC8A uploaded on the portal is all you could see, witness, not really. A.B., what else? There are many blonde images of EC8A, A.B. Prof, when you were referring to blonde image of EC8A, you are not suggesting that the hard copies must also be blown. Witness, I didn't, see, I didn't see the physical copies. And he went on again to say, 
in all your review you didn't see anything on the portal that suggests that there is an electronic collision sense system witness the rf portal is electronic collision system a b are you suggesting that the portal is capable of collecting and tribulating the ele election results weakness it is not capable of doing that a b in your your wsoo you made reference to 18,000 polling units with blood results then you use labor party agent result page 8 in affidavits e witness yes please note that ab muhammad san that is cross-examining professor eric is INEC counsel not INEC chairman i hope we all understand this so let's go back again to read ab muhammad did you attach them to your reports witness i didn't ab you aren't an election expert witness it depends on what you mean ab what do you understand to be experts i suggest that there is no way you would have been able to undertake the tax in page two paragraph three i can i can determine it ab muhammad now went ahead to say what did you conclude when did you conclude your assignment witness 19th march ab look at that page that is pcb2 ab read out the local government area witness the gamma digima local government polling unit ward 007 while looking at the results ab muhammad accredited voter is 40 voters is also 40 no over voting correct witness no over voting he continue ab son has rested for INEC for now second and third respondent which is bola ahmed tinibu and shetima council we cross examining professor eric next stay tuned we welcome back and then we have aki son of second and third respondent to cross examining the witness the w or the witness stand for aki son voters are votes are cast at the polling unit witness yes at the end of the election the vote cast will be sorted sorted counted and recorded in ec8a witness yes it is the image of this ec8a that will be translated to the irf witness yes the hard copy of ec8a will be taken by the presiding officer to the ward coalition center witness yes aki this the statutory channel of coalition is from pulling units to ward to local government to states to national witness yes aki san went ahead it is part of your claim in your report that some forms you downloaded from irev were blood will i be correct to say that whether the whether whether transmission of the result from pulling units to irev failed or what you downloaded to irev wasn't blood it won't change the result at the polling units witness it will not change if it is properly used Akisan. IREV is not a coalition center. True, witness. It is not a coalition center. Akisan went ahead to ask again. Your reports cover only two states, Benue and Rivers. The witness said yes. Aki, did you tender 
from Oyo? Witness, no. Did you tender for any other states? Witness. Thank you for watching and see you next time.